that the Alliance would flourish on Odessan, but I didn't expect this place to feel so much like home. You should be proud of what you've built here, and the allies you've gained. I couldn't have done it without you. Someone had to do all the hard work while you were off gallivanting. The Alliance is still a formidable power, but we're not strong enough to face the Republic or the Empire. Unfortunately, a confrontation is inevitable. There are skirmishes in wild space, riots on Quesh. Galactic war is imminent. We can no longer afford neutrality. If the Alliance is to survive, we must align ourselves with the Republic or the Empire. Whatever you decide, we'll follow your lead. You'd accept orders from the Republic? I'd do all that and more if you asked me. The Empire has no hold on me. I follow you and you alone. So who do you wish to support? The Republic or the Empire? The Republic has won me over. Of course. And as a former hero of the Empire, you could easily sabotage them from the inside. It's unlikely you'll fight the Empire openly, but are you comfortable with betraying your former allies? Or killing them? I'll support you either way, so please consider carefully. The Empire is my past. But the Republic is my future. Of course. Republic SIS has been trying to recruit you for ages, but I kept turning them down. I'll contact them shortly. They'll be in touch soon. It really is lovely out here. It's been ages since I've watched a sunset. But we should get back. 
I've received over a dozen holocalls since we left. They can wait. I suppose I could stay out a little longer. Oh, I forgot to tell Baywan about the delayed fuel shipment. Lana? Right. Yes. Sunset now, work later. Love the Corellian sector. Best starshine surprise on Nar Shada. First round is on me. You finally made it. Could you bring me another K3? Wait, make that two. Well, if it isn't my traitor friend, welcome to the party. Keep your voice down. Relax, you're among friends. Half the patrons are SIS. Jonas Balker, Republic SIS. Can't blame you for abandoning the imps, but it was a bit of a surprise. If it were up to me, we'd welcome you with open arms. Unfortunately, you'll have to keep up appearances and support the Empire. Haven't I already proven my loyalty? I've been playing this game for years. And you've done an amazing job of it, too. Not many people can maintain such an impeccable cover. We simply can't afford to throw away your network in the Empire. With war on the horizon, the imps are desperate for medical supplies, fuel, and raw resources. We just have to beat them to it. While you're at it, be sure to make some disparaging remarks about the Empire. With a face like yours, the imps will be drinking in every word. If I'm facing Republic forces, I can't guarantee there won't be collateral damage. Unfortunately, it comes with the territory. Just do what you can to keep the damage to a minimum, when the imps aren't looking, at least. Tensions are rising on the planet Osis. With the help of your alliance, the Republic could gain the upper hand. We're still working out the details, so I'll be in touch once you're back on Odessin. This meeting will be our little secret. K3, you're right on time. That one's all yours. My friend was just leaving. See you around, Commander. Greetings, Commander. I am Moff Pardon, Overseer of the Sith Empire's 22nd Assault Fleet. Though I have not been made privy to the details of your intelligence career, what I have heard was quite impressive. That you have risen to the leadership of such an influential galactic faction is only fitting. I hope to strengthen the bond of friendship between your Alliance and the Empire. I'm glad to hear it. What exactly do you have in mind? A small Imperial strike team is currently engaged in a covert operation on the ancient Jedi world of Osus. 
I am hoping that you can provide them with some assistance. What kind of assistance? The operation is being overseen by a younger member of the Dark Council. Darth Malora, Head of Scientific Advancement. While Malora possesses a brilliant mind, not unlike Empress Asina, she has little of Asina's patience for the subtleties of military operations. Malora's objective was meant to be completed by now. Pressed to deliver results, she will likely hurl troops at the problem without regard for strategy. My finest infantry soldiers, Raven Squad, are participating in the operation. It would be a great loss to the Empire if their lives were wasted. Your concern for your soldiers is admirable. Thank you. I only wish to ensure the Empire's greatest possible success in future operations. As a member of the Dark Council, Malora is beyond my influence. But someone like yourself, an outsider whose allegiance is greatly valued, you could accomplish much that I cannot. I can investigate the situation. What is the strike team's mission on Osus? The Jedi have established a secret colony on the planet. We believe they're using it to train and ready themselves for war. The Jedi's numbers are already low. If this training compound can be destroyed, we will be at an inarguable advantage when full-scale hostilities begin. I assume an orbital bombardment is out of the question. Approaching Osus is treacherous for large ships. The effort would be time-consuming, allowing the Jedi opportunity to escape and creating a weakness in our fleet's disposition elsewhere. I will forward all of my available data on Malora and the operation. Your assistance will no doubt ensure the mission's success. I am certain that Empress Asina will be most appreciative. Thank you for your time, Commander. I shall look forward to word of your triumph. Glory to the Empire! We'll see about that, Moff. I would recommend that you travel to Osus alone. We wouldn't want Malora or her troops to see this as a show of force, or confuse her with unexpected allies. Translation, definitely don't take the former Republic spy, or anyone else they might be inclined to shoot on sight. It is important to make a good first impression. Great. We're back on the haircut. Surely you could come with me, Lana. I would love nothing more. But I'm not especially popular with my fellow Sith. I don't know Melora, but I'd rather not chance it. I'll see that a shuttle is prepared for you. May the Force serve you well, Commander.